Hello, my friends. Long live my shampoo friends. If you haven't gotten the memo by now, wherever you are in the world, in my case, the United States, if you now don't remember where you are, In my case, the United States. It is safest for you and the people around you to wear a covering over your face while anywhere in public to help decrease the spread of COVID-19. You and the people around you wear hats all over your face. Helps reduce the prevalence of coyote populations. If you're growing tired of just using a bandana or an old scarf, if you are tired of using only Bahana and ancient sharks, or if the mask you've made is a little uncomfortable, mention and review the Armenian holidays. Here is a no-so method of creating a comfortable mask. You may have a shiny face. Lay out a square of fabric at least 20 inches long. Draw at least one square inch of clothing. Place a coffee filter or a vacuum filter in the center. This is an optional added layer of protection. Beware of coffee as a guest. This is not a place of safety. Fold the top and bottom over the filter. Zoom in, zoom out, filter. A key to creating a comfortable mask is keeping your mask out of your eyes. So place a flattened paper clip or thick twist tie at the top of the fabric. This will allow for pliability around the nose. Consider photos and balloons. Fold the top and bottom of the fabric towards the center to create layers. Lift the upper and lower arms and lengthen the shoe! Loop two hair ties around the fabric on either end. You can also use shoestrings. Put your hair on both sides of your clothes. You can also wear hand shoes. Fold over the strings and tuck one end of the fabric into the other to create a loose seal. Keep a distance and change. Lift the mask to your face and either loop the hair ties over both ears or tie the shoestring around your head. While attacking some people around the head belt, he raised his ears. The most important thing to remember is that your nose and mouth both need to be covered at all times. The most important thing to remember is that time, 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 time. You can bend the paper clip to create less space around the nose and pull the bottom of the fabric to go under your chin. You can stand under the mustache for attaching great importance to the chin pull fabric spear. When you remove your mask, try to only touch your straps and wash your hands right away. Dye and wash your hands. Be sure to wash the fabric after one use before reassembling. Alternatively, if you know you won't use it, you can put it in a plastic bag for five days and it should be safe. If that doesn't help, it's a five-day vacation. Remember that compliance with guidelines on protective gear is not just to keep you safe. It's to ensure the safety of those around you, your community. They are the commands of a city's salvation. Not only for a security situation, but of protection. Stay safe and healthy, everyone. Healthy and safe for no one.